the Bellevue West boys and girls basketball teams took on Lincoln Pius on Saturday, December 11th. In the girls game, it would be a battle. With time winding down the first quarter, Taryn Warren's three doesn't quite go. But sophomore Anka Russell Brown is there for the putback to end the quarter. Brown would end up having 10 points on the night. Later in the second quarter, senior Grace Schaefer goes to the rim and gets an unbelievable reverse layup and gets the foul. Schaefer would end up having 5 points on the night. With little time left now in the fourth quarter, Bellevue West has a chance to win the game, but time runs out and the game goes to overtime. In overtime, Lincoln Pius' Madeline Navarcole gets a big rebound and puts it in the hoop to give Pius a 2 point lead. But then just seconds later, senior Taryn Warren hits a deep 3 to give West a 1 point lead with just 1 minute to go. Warren would have 16 points in the game. Seconds later now with 30 seconds to go, game tied at 50, but Taryn Wharton does it again to give West a 3 point lead. Now with just seconds to go in the game, Pius has a chance to tie it, but it doesn't go as the Thunderbirds win 53-50 to over the defending state champions, and Pius... His 34 game winning streak comes to an end as the Thunderbirds advance their record to 3-1. On the boys side, it would be more of a one-sided affair. In the first quarter, Pius is trying to get something going, but it's William Kyle with the outstanding block. Josiah Dosler then takes the ball and goes down the court and gets the layup to go. Dosler would have 20 points on the night. Pius wouldn't go away too easily as Jared Boher hits a D3 in front of William Kyle. Boher would have 30 points on the night. In the second half, the T-Birds would start running away at the game as Junior Jackson Stuvey gets the assist to go to Evan Inselman. Later in the quarter, Josiah Dosler goes down the court and gives the ball to William Kyle and gets the layup to go. Kyle would end up having 14 points on the night along with 5 blocks. In the fourth quarter, Josiah Dosler puts the cherry on top hitting a deep three to extend the T-Birds lead. The lead would continue as the T-Birds also win with a final score of 95-68 and advance their record to 6-0.